Mr. Midnight, you can't. Oh, I love you. No. God, I love cats. Chapter one, my sober day. Hey guys, my name is Oranges, and welcome to Fran Bo. It's a point and click adventure where I guess we go through, we're playing as a girl named Fran, and I, from the synopsis of it anyways, it sounds like she witnessed her parents' death. And from that, she's dealing with a whole bunch of stuff, and the word mental disorder was thrown in there. And if any of you do know me, I am a huge advocate of, of for people with disabilities. Um, it is my day job, it's what I do, I work with these people who have different abilities, and it's just... <sighs> so close to my heart. <laughs> so anyways, let's just jump into this. Let's see, it's a horror game too, so I mean... Let's see some oranges get scared, I guess. Whatever. New game. This game uses all the same features. Here we go! Everything's fine. Do I click or what here? What here? It feels like heaven. Oh, ooh, creepy eyes. I see my parents. Mm. They look happy. They have a present for me. I wonder. <gasps> it's a picnic. We're going on a picnic. Oh, it's a kitty. It's a cat. So sweet and pretty. Dark as the deepest night. Hey, it's like my Revan. Where is he? It's Mr. Midnight. That's cute. My best friend. My only friend. <laughs> All right. We're having dinner, and I see Aunt Grace, too. I really like her a lot. It's Friday. My parents are going out. And Grace takes good care of me. Well, I like how the cat's just sitting there licking the, the milk. We're having so much fun. It's Monday night and I'm playing with Mr. Midnight. Oh no. But something feels real bad. <sighs> A strange creature outside my window. I don't like it, it scares me. Suddenly I hear something. Oh my fuck. It's mom, screaming. Uh, I don't like this. No, 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 no. I want to know what's wrong. A bright light shines from my parents' room. I go closer. Oh, fuck no. Oh, no, 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 darn it, no. And closer. A knife! Mom? Dad? Uh, those eyeballs. Mm. Please don't. Oh, no! Oh, no! Why is the roof bleeding? Oh, that cat, he's so, so loyal. <gasps> he sees something. Don't you hurt this cat, please. Oh my God, please don't hurt the cat. Why are they in robes? Why are they in robes? Friend, please follow my voice. On the count of three, you will wake up. Where's Mr. Midnight? One. Two. All right. Three. Fran, how do you feel? Wow, this looks amazing. I feel like dying. Let's go with A. I'm fine. I guess I'm just sad to see the same things. Sadness is sometime, something everybody has within. I want to find the killer. I really want to kill my parents. The police are working on it. Why is that flickering? That's creepy. I'll find my cat and the killer. The police are working on it. Nobody does anything. I'll find my cat and the killer. And my cat. <laughs> Your cat is missing. It would be impossible to get him back. No, you don't say that. That's horrible. 
But now I have something for you, friend. See the desk? There's a little package for you. It's from Aunt Grace. Take it. I guess. Oh, okay. We got some clicker. Ah, it's a severed hand. This was my mother's purse. Open it. There's something inside. God, the art style in this game is wicked. Oh. It's a note. Examine. Here's the purse you like so much. I thought you would like to have it. When I was thinking about you, I remember that you like to <laughs> examine objects and combine them with other things. So, I hope you'll always keep this purse and give it uh, and all the other things you find a good use. I thought that said USB for a minute. Never forget that creativity is absolutely the greatest gift you have. She's worried about you. And Grace? Well, another reason to let me go. Well, don't worry about her. She is fine. Can I leave now? Let me go, Mr. Doc Face. I want to know, what's his name? Yes, you can leave, but before you do, it is time for your new medicine. No more medicine. Excuse me. It's called Duotine, and it will make you feel very relaxed. Nurse, we're ready. Duotine. Anything new today, Dr. Dern? Nothing, actually. Same visions as before. Oh, I see. Here, friend, take your medicine. I guess. I mean, I don't want to. Is that it? I don't feel good. No, no, those medications... Were... Whoa! Whoa, what the fuck is that? What the heck is that? Oh no, take her back to her room. No, you take me to the emergency room and get my stomach pumped. Don't let her take this ever again. We're gonna have to take that medicine to go back to find out who the killer was because that's the stuff we saw that night. Beware, friend, Bo. How do we know it's Bo and not Bow? If you leave the house of madness... I will hunt you down. Catch you. And bring you back to insanity. Oh my gosh. Kitty cat. Fran, wake up. The medicine will help you escape. I'll be waiting for you in the forest. Mr. Midnight, you can't. Oh, I love you. No. God, I love cats. Chapter one, my sober day. All right, friend. Let's kick this day in the ass. What do we got? Okay, we got some flickering. We got a clown. Eh, clown house. Can we wake up? We got a cross. I'm still here. Hideous place. I have to get out of here. And with my help, you will. Let's check what's in this. Locked. Good reason to get curious. I'll say. We got a toy. Oh, sweet, sweet melody. One more time, la la la. It does the same as before, huh? The patient was found near the Oswald Asylum, showing signs of psychosis. The Bo Dra Dagenhart family. Oh my god, that's a cool name. Uh, details omitted. Treatment. Dr. Marcel Dern. Marcel. Bleh. Dr. Marcel Dern has tried different medications, and all have been canceled because of the side effects. Hopefully this won't fall on my head while I'm sleeping. I always had that fear when there was something behind me. Like, I, the reason I don't put pictures behind me above my bed is because I'm scared that they'll fall. I know that some people put, like, swords and shit, and it's like, ah, that's like Final Destination bullshit. Don't do that. What's the matter with you? Ah, clown face. I will get your nose. I will get it. Sweet. Hook. Handy hook. I'll save it to play pirate later. It's a little box. It's open. Okay. A little box, it's open. Okay, so use it. <gasps> Key. Sorry, buddy. I'll be back. Let's use our key on that. See if that works. Why would that little boy have that key in his chest? So now we got a bow. My hair clip. I should give it a good use. And a family picture. <gasps> 
Aunt Grace? No, Aunt Grace, Mother and Father, and Midnight. Okay. Let's go back this way. We'll talk to Mr. Pale. Hello, Phil. Hello. There's a lot going on. I saw the doctor write a secret code. Okay, what was the code, little Phil? You gotta tell me the code. To open the yellow door. He doesn't want me to tell you. <gasps> Ooh. The horse? No. Oh my gosh! All doors are closed. You are a prisoner of my games. <coughs> Owie. And nobody will help you escape. Leave me alone. I hate you. Mommy, Daddy, I need you so much right now. No, I won't let that monster stop me. Mr. Teddy? I hope somebody loves you. Oh, that's horrible. Hello, Mr. Wooden Horse. Let's see what Phil's deal is. The patient came to Oswald Asylum with his mother, Rachel Bronstone. The boy has developed a paranoid behavior, paranoia not yet diagnosed. Daily treatment with Dr. Marcel Dern. We have not achieved the patient's trust, and he refuses to be questioned. Documented. April 6, 1944. So that gives us a real big idea of when this takes place. We're done here. Uh, Phil's done his thing. 1944. And you know, back in, like, even just recently, the times have changed so much for our abilities to help people with disabilities right now. And before, it was there was so much stigma around it. It was just filled with ignorance. And the way we treated people with disabilities was disgusting. They used to test people to see if they belonged in an asylum and if they were uh, intellectually disabled by their IQ. And they used to sterilize people and it's just, oh my gosh, it is just horrible to even think about. And now this game is making me think about it. <sighs> towels? Towels? I don't need no towels! Okay, let's talk to Nurse Gertrude. Oh, friend, you're awake. Good. How long was I asleep? Tell me, Gertrude. Three days. Oh my god. Taking this now. Ha ha! This is mine. I can't read that. Oh, her name is Gladys. That's good. Here we go. Let's go back now. What are these papers? I didn't see those before. I'm sure they were there. Oh yeah, I did see them. I hate the monster. Okay, creep. She went through this door. Of course, it's locked. Sh oh, I got you. I got you. I'm, I'm stupid. Uh, oh, I, I did take the gun. Okay, let's see. Okay, so I or sorry, eight, nine, four, five, eight, nine, four, five. Use. Eight, nine, four, five. Yes. Okay, so we got our pills. Little Killing told me the demons would help me. That was loud and obnoxious. Okay, what we're going to do. Get out, creepy creature. Hello, Miss Nurse. Watch your step. You got a little blood on your mouth. Are you okay? It was not me. Look at this chump. Oh, is that my head? Give me my head back, please. Just go away, you weird creatures. Oh my gosh! This game is horrifying! <gasps> Phil, what have they done to you? We kind of do need to tell... What's that? Ah, okay. Excuse me, nurse. This may be useful. Gotcha. Here we go. Okay. We gotta go back to this room. We have... Use this. Combine it with this. Use that on the door. Boom! Okay, let's go in for... Oh! Daddy was not there. Mommy would not care. <gasps> let's get out of here. What's your name? Little Susie. That's your name. Your name is Susie, I bet. Hello. You see them. You do, right? I don't. Bye. <laughs> you bitch. See what? 
The creatures that follow everyone. Oh my god, every kid in here can see it. I can't see them, but I know they are there. Do you know what they are? Yeah, I guess. What are they? They're demons. Tell me. You like to draw? I love to draw. Here we go. Crayon! A crayon! I want to find a crayon. I draw all the time. What are you drawing? Something! Oh, <laughs> you're such a vag douche! What is it? My dreams go now. Oh, flowers. Drawer is empty. Okay. So, do oh, let's see what our name is before we go. Uh, Adelaide. Adelaide? Fugents? Mmm. The king, oh, likes drawings. <gasps> no! Out. With love. <clears throat> oh, you really started off. <clears throat> Fuck you, man. Ow. God pities you. Yeah, well, you're a fucking shark. So, suck a dick. <laughs>